Hello, I will speak today about permethylated two-dimensional metal organic frameworks as promising candidates for emerging two-dimensional materials. I will present multiple aspects related to the research in our group on two-dimensional coordination polymers. Uh, in introduction, I will I want to mention the first revolutionary two-dimensional material was graphene, which was obtained by exfoliation of graphite and inspired by its structure and properties, further studies focusing, focused on metal organic two-dimensional uh, networks. Uh, the two-dimensional coordination uh, polymers contain both organic and inorganic blocks, which offer wide possibilities for structural diversification and areas of applicability. Uh, these two-dimensional polymers are distinguished primarily by chemical tunability and their high structural porosity, which has impressive nano size effects. Uh, these polymers also have an array of properties of interest for uh, multiple application with uh, uh, added value. The properties can be controlled by multiple uh, factors as the synthetic chemist so chooses. The main challenges uh, for, this, uh, for the synthesis of these polymers are related to the large scale production of such uh, coordination polymers. Uh, with a good quality, with good stability of the individual nano sheets. Uh, there are two main approaches for exfoliating stacked two dimensional polymers. One is top down and the other is uh, bottom up. Uh, we will show in this presentation several two dimensional coordination networks that we recently obtained in which the interpenetration of the layers and the interaction between them are avoided or limited by the use of appropriate ligands. For the preparation of two-dimensional coordina coordination polymers as easily delaminable nanosheets, we use one free bis-carboxypropyl tetramethyl disiloxan ligand marked here as H2L1 with several organic nitrogen heterocycles as coal ligands. And the uh, Permethylated coordination polymers were synthesized by co coordination chemistry of decarboxylic acid with a tetramethyl disiloxane spacer as a reticular anionic crosslinker, marked here as H2L1, in combination with a nitrogen uh, heterocyclic compound as neutral ligand, marked uh, as L2 for several uh, transition metals from metal salts marked as MX. An entire library of two-dimensional coordination polymers was uh, synthesized as single crystals using the tetramethyl disiloxane spaced decarboxylic acid and nitrogen heterocycle colligands by diversifying the permethylated component by the synthesis of new carboxylic compounds to contain it or by locating it in the coal ligand. These uh, coordination polymers were further characterized in terms of thermal properties, magnetic behavior, water vapor sorption and gas sorption capability. The uh, Coordination polymers can be isolated as single crystals and can be analyzed by polarized light microscopy, by scanning electron microscopy and transmission electron microscopy. The results from X-ray diffraction analysis show the orientation of the uh, tetramethyl disiloxane segments on both sides of the two-dimensional array in the left image and the layered packing uh, of the uh, polymers in the right image. The two dimensional layers interact by Van der Waals forces. And 
the uh, coordination polymers show a hydrophobic behavior uh, as tested uh, by uh, static uh, contact angle measurements and also have high porosity of the crystal structure. The two-dimensional coordination polymers also have capacity for self-assembly as aggregates from a solvent in a matrix that can be either a polymer such as PDMS or an organic material such as uh, pyrene. The functional groups on the edges of the two-dimensional coordination network show chemical reactivity with a possible arrangement of three functional carboxylic groups uh, at the edge of the two-dimensional layer. The analysis by fluorescence and infrared spectroscopy demonstrated the complexation by the free carboxylate groups of other metal ions, such as europium. The uh, coordination polymers have shown clear uh, salt metathesis reaction with the possibility to exchange cations such as cobalt with copper or cobalt with europium. Similar to inorganic two-dimensional materials, the coordination polymers can be exfoliated in nanosheets by ultrasonication in low to medium polarity liquids such as uh, tetrahydrofuran. The coordination polymers have the capacity of photo switching under uh, UV light can self-organize into micron-sized formations as shown in the uh, uh, atomic force microscopy images here. In conclusion, the presence of the nanosheet uh, on the nanosheet surface of metal groups limits the intermolecular interactions, allowing easier further delamination of the aggregates. The synthesized coordination polymers show surface activity and self-assembly capacity in solution. The coordination polymers can interact through the uh, end groups and can participate in cation exchange reactions, metathesis reaction, and are responsive to multiple stimuli such as ultraviolet light and magnetic field. Thank you for your attention.